Welcome or welcome back to the show. I'm Anna and you're watching Anna Speaks Out. All right. Here is my Hungry Roots subscription box. Let's get it inside. Okay, so I have a Hungry Roots subscription box here. You can't see it, I promise it's here. So it's been sitting outside my door for over an hour and a half because I've been getting up late. And apparently it was delivered at around 9 a.m. And it's now after 10.30. But let's hope their ice really held up. All right, so I didn't realize I got this because I have pancake mix, but we always have a lot of pancake mix at home. But we have multi-grain pancake and waffle mix. And uh, this is like my um, receipt type of thing. Invoice, yeah. It has some recipes on the back. Organic low sodium garbanzo beans. This must go with one of the recipes. Tzatziki bison veggie bowl. Goes with that. Brown rice quinoa blend. Chocolate chip cookies, a little snack. Fruit snacks, but they're like 100% fruit, no added sugar, high in fiber, gluten free, vegan. 15% profits donated to wildaid.org to help save our chums. <clears throat> Hopefully that's actually a good cause. This looks good. Superfood smoothie pineapple strawberry with prebiotic fiber, fiber plant protein, flax, and kamu kamu. I don't even know what that is. I might have that right now, <clears throat> honestly, because I need to eat. It'd probably be best if it was refrigerated. That's good. Meat stick. Got one of these last time. I like that. This is slightly cold still. This still feels cold. I really need to get them in the, in the fridge. Classic potato super fries. Made with russet potato, cauliflower, and chickpea. Oh, I've been looking forward to these, but it's smaller than I thought it would be. Donut holes. Oh, wait, actually. I don't know. It's kind of small. Dairy and gluten-free. 41% less sugar than your average, I guess. Tzatziki. Cucumbers, they feel cold. Sesame ginger, like dressing, you know, all this goes into specific recipes that they plan for you. Super blend salad. Cucumber corn, black bean salad. Lettuce, um, looks like um, parts of romaine. Broccoli florets. Looks like these are non organic, though. Hmm. Okay, well. I'm going to turn off the camera and put those in the fridge and then I'll continue. I got some of my uh, trusty Olipop ginger ale out of the fridge. It can never be, never be without this or something similar these days. Okay, now we have the lower half of the box is separated by this thing. The box is surrounded by insulative materials that felt cool to the touch. And we have some egg white wraps. Interesting. This definitely feels more cold. Super chai 
fuel, 12 grams of protein with almond milk, hemp seeds, maca, cardamom, prebiotics, 100% plant-based shake. I think I'm gonna try that right now. Has 15% of your daily iron. Pretty good. It's a little like chalky, but flavor's not bad. It's okay. This would be good like mixed in with like iced coffee. I can't even handle coffee these days. Got three different things going at once right now. Typical. All right. Little tiny bit of chicken. <laughs> I guess that's for a recipe. This is my my free item that I get in every order right now. It's pretty good. Almond chickpea cookie dough. Got it in my last order. Some Thousand Island dressing. It says vegan. Oh, there's another little chicken. See it like each of these must be for one serving. It says fully cooked, ready to eat. Interesting. Chicken raised without antibiotics or hormones. Vegetarian fed. <clears throat> yes, yeah, another thing I was looking forward to. Sparkling probiotic goodness, kombucha, ginger boost. Notes of ginger, lemongrass, and mint. That seems like it'd be good for the nausea. Okay. And these things are more cold than the top stuff. Blueberry jasmine kombucha, but that's gonna be good. Unpasteurized, probiotic, gluten-free, brewed in Nashville, Tennessee. Blackened grilled chicken breast, raised with no antibiotics. It is previously frozen though. It looks pretty good. Hot smoke, hot smoked roasted salmon. That's gonna be good. I've always liked smoked salmon. Product of the USA. It's good. <laughs> I would hope so. Oh. Like eating meat shipped in all the way from another country sounds scary. Boneless beef ribeye steak. Man, I wonder if I'm even gonna be in the mood for that. I haven't like wanted stuff that's like that heavy lately. Bison for stew meat. I got this partly just cause like, I don't know if I've ever tried, I might've tried bison like once before. So I wanted to try it. Raised without antibiotics or hormones. And there is this big giant ice pack in the bottom of there. So that helps a lot. And lastly, cilantro lime chicken. And so that's it. If you liked what you saw here and would like to try Hungry Root for yourself for a limited time, you can use the referral code that you see in blue on the screen here when you sign up and you'll get $50 off of your first order. And it will also give me a $50 credit, so you'll be helping me get some free groceries. Thank you so much for watching, and I'll see you in the next one. God bless.